So you're most likely wondering how I got into this situation. Well, it all started with him, Tricky, the clown. One of the most terrifying antagonists on Friday Night Funkin', who is now in Among Us, who is putting up the world of Among Us up in flames, and we have to stop him. But before we get any further into this video, if you're new to the channel, want to see more stories, make sure that you hit that red subscribe button with the bell icon turned on, and drop a like on this video if you do enjoy. But now, let's begin. So my encounter with Tricky started off on the airship, which is one of my favorite maps in Among Us. I was really excited to play. I was finally out of school, and I was running around the lobby in excitement, but this would all soon fade away. I was the imposter, and I spawned in records and I was so excited to get a win. I had a long day at school telling all my friends about Friday Night Funkin' and how much I enjoyed playing that game. But I wanted to play Among Us, and I was so lucky to be the imposter. I was looking around the map for crewmates, but everyone was gone. I did eventually find Cyan and Medical, but that was about it. So I called Lights and I was thinking about taking out Cyan, but then Lime walked in. So I left, and I have to look for another option. I then entered the gap room and I went up the ladders. And I took out one of the crewmates. I then vented into the main hall. I was thinking about venting into the main hall, but Blue was there. But after he left, I vented out. And I went down into security to check the cameras, where I did find the body and I also saw Blue report it. Hopefully me checking cameras makes me less suspicious. Since the body was reported, I let the crewmates know that it was in the meeting room, because I was checking on cameras but they were suspecting me. Blue then sent a weird message. How did Chari go through the wall? I don't remember doing that. Lime then responded with, Chari went through a wall? How would I do that? I was then ejected, but I don't remember going through a wall. And everyone in the lobby said I did. Is there someone else here? When we returned back to the dropship, I said, wait, what? I didn't go through the walls. And I was kicked out for something I didn't do. I couldn't tell if the crewmates were telling the truth or just messing with me. But I left and I joined a full lobby of 10 players. This time I wasn't so lucky and I wasn't the imposter. So hopefully that fixes the issue. But as I was doing my task and records, I kept freezing in random locations, which didn't make any sense. A body was reported and I cleared white, but then we ejected black. Hopefully he was the imposter because I didn't have any evidence on him. I then spawned in the brig, and I could hear the sound of flames, and I couldn't tell where it was coming from. I thought it came from engine, but I didn't see anything. And that's when the lights turned off, and this fire creature appeared! It was Tricky from Friday Night Funkin'. He then teleported, and was nowhere to be seen. I was panicking in an engine. What is Tricky doing here? And then Brown got me. Isn't Tricky a clown? Who has several forms, but he was covered in flames. I could then hear the laughs of a clown. Is he after me? A body was then reported, and I responded with, what was that? He just disappeared, but nobody seemed to know what I was talking about. The clown continued to laugh, which forced me to leave the game. Why is Tricky after me? I wanted to join an FNF lobby. I wanted to ask them why Tricky was here, but I was already banned from the lobby, even though I never joined. I joined another lobby and it let me in, but I just had this strange feeling that Tricky was here. I don't know what he has against me. I've always been afraid of clowns, especially during Halloween. You never know when they're gonna show up. And then I was just disconnected from the lobby. I don't know why I was randomly disconnected, so I got into another lobby, but then I could hear Tricky's laugh. Where is it coming from? And then I was disconnected. Again. I had no idea why I was disconnected from those two lobbies. Tricky the Clown was after me, and I needed to make my escape. I spawned in records, and I made my way over to Electrical, and the crash course was called, and I could hear his evil laugh, but I'm just gonna ignore it and complete my task, since going over to fix the sabotage may end very bad. I then decided to enter records to go to my next task, and that's when I found Cyan, and Rose's dead body. 
I had a feeling that maybe Cyan was the one that did it, but I wasn't entirely sure. It looked like Cyan was making their way out, but I could be wrong. Cyan was also being very dramatic. I don't know if she was trying to pull the suspicion away, but she did mention that I came up right behind her, and I let them know that I came from electrical but that it did seem like Cyan entered records and then came back in to report the body. I did also mention that I'll skip, I'll give you another chance. So I skipped but Cyan was saying that it could be me. So just because I'm telling you what I saw, I'm suspicious? Okay. All the votes then went towards me. I was the only one that skipped and I could hear Tricky the Clown's evil laugh, almost as if he planned it all and wanted this to happen. I was really upset so I left the game. What did I ever do to Tricky for him to come after me? I went back to the same lobby because I wanted to have a word with Tricky the Clown. Why is he after me? I found Purple in the main hall and he was acting really suspicious. I wanted to be far away from him. I then saw someone in electrical and that's when I saw Rose in security and the lights began to turn off. So I ran out of the area and I entered engine and that's when I could hear Tricky the Clown. He then appeared right in front of me and quickly disappeared. My character then completely froze in time. How can I escape this? But it seems that there is no end. I then got myself into another game. Why is Tricky the Clown after me? I spawned in the main hall and I was now looking around the engine room. Where could Tricky the Clown be coming from? Could it be the engines? What could it be? And why is he on fire? A sabotage was called so I was forced to go fix it. Could this be a sign of Tricky the Clown? Was he the one that called the sabotage? I was looking around the engine after the sabotage was fixed. I wanted to see if Tricky the Clown was summoned, but he wasn't. I then noticed that someone was watching me on cameras, and I wanted to leave the room but the door was closed, on the right side and the top. So I went over to security to see who was the player that was watching me, and it was black but then communications was sabotaged. What are the odds that the moment that I go check, sabotage is called? So after communications was fixed, I went to go check the cameras again, and they were completely off. I was about to leave the main hall, and that's when I heard Tricky the Clown behind me. So I went back into the engine room, and another sabotage was called. I was gonna go fix it, but then I heard him behind me, so I went back. And that's when Tricky the Clown appeared and burned my player. If you want to know what happened next, make sure to drop a like down below and subscribe to the channel. And check out these other stories.